Everton, what was the main attraction for you to return here? <laughs> no, it's just uh, the club on its own, uh, the players, the manager, the supporters. Um, at the end of the season, uh, it was a bit, uh, what can I say, um, yeah, sad to say goodbye. And uh, I spoke to the manager just before I left, and that's when I made up my mind that I, I really want to come back to the club. And yeah, that was it basically. Was there a chance that you, you wouldn't have come back then? I don't know, uh, <laughs> to be fair. But uh, I, I made it clear to the manager that if the opportunity comes, I'll really want to come back. And uh, and he promised me he'll do whatever it takes uh, to make it happen. And I'm glad he uh, showed so much trust and believed in me. And he brought me back, so I'm really glad. I was just wondering because you know you look at a new manager at Spurs and maybe the thought might have been there that what might happen there. Yeah, um, over the holidays um, I had a thought, but then again I followed my heart. Uh, told myself I've made up my mind already before I went back to training. So it was just basically for me to to wait for the deal to be done. How surprised were you how well the second half of the season was for Everton last year because with Jelovic coming. It really transformed the club, didn't it? Yeah, but I think uh, it's every season the same story with Everton. <laughs> it's not only last season, but uh, I think uh, we just uh, have to get it. I think it's like a, like a drug, basically, for the club. The players tend to wake up uh, in the second half of the season. But hopefully we can uh, work towards it this season and get a good start and, and finish, uh, finish well. Why didn't it work for you at Spurs, do you think? Yeah, it's football. I mean, uh, you, wherever you go, uh, you give 100%. And, you know, but for whatever reason it doesn't work, uh, you just have to yeah, keep your head up and uh, move on and leave the past behind you. And that's what I did. I gave it everything. It didn't work out. So at least I'm, I left with my head up. And I'm proud that I played for the club. What is it that attracts you about Everton coming back in? Now, the season ahead, what can they achieve? Do you feel? No, so it's more my family wanted to come back. <laughs> now it's uh, just the club uh, gave me the opportunity to play uh, in the Premier League, and you know, whenever I got opportunity to come back, uh, it was it was basically just easy for me to to make a decision. But, but I just listen to Tim Cahill the other day who thought there might be a, a bit of a problem in, in the fact that, you know, um, without the money and resources, uh, do you see a problem at all in that respect, looking forward to this season? No, I don't. Um, I think the last couple of seasons the club have been working on a tight budget and to be fair, the manager been doing a well job and uh, I think if it's uh, the issue, I think we've got the same, same players and uh, hopefully, like I said, we can just start start the season bright and end it uh, on a good note. And it's important for you to keep the likes of Leighton Bain, so you have that great partnership with them. Yeah, it's not up to me, it's up to the club to keep the, the best players, but uh, hopefully uh, you'll stay and uh, so will the rest of the guys.